Hello everyone, my name is Mr. Chills. Sure you know what this video is all about. Can't hear you? It's about Halloween, that's right. And you know it's the coolest holiday of all. So before we move with the cool stuff, let's find out some of the basic facts about Halloween. Follow me. On October 31st, many people in the world celebrate Halloween. Halloween means holy, hallow, and evening, eve. This is the evening before the Christian holiday of All Saints Day. On this day, Christians remember the saints. But Halloween is even older than Christianity. Before Christianity, people in Europe believed that on October 31st, ghosts of dead people came back. To scare the ghosts, people dressed like devils and were very noisy. They also made big fires to keep the ghosts away. Later, people did not believe in ghosts, but they kept the day of Halloween for fun. Immigrants came from Europe to America and brought with them the custom of Halloween. Halloween has some strange symbols. One symbol is the jack-o'-lantern, usually placed on the window to scare away the ghosts. People cut the pumpkin, throw away all the insides and cut a face in it. They put a candle inside of it. Today in the United States, Britain and many other countries, Halloween is very popular with children. They wear masks and special costumes. They want to look like skeletons, witches and ghosts. They go from house to house and say trick or treat. People give them candies, cookies or even fruits. When people give nothing, the children sometimes play tricks on them. Hi everyone, Hi again. I hope you learned something from this story about Halloween. Did you? Alright, let's check. Are you ready for some fun activities? These are designed to see if you have understood it all. So let's start. Take a look at these words here. Saints, scare, ghosts, play tricks, masks and skeletons. They are all from the story about Halloween. Now, you will see six sentences with underlined words. And you have to replace the underlined words with these Alright, are you ready? If you need more time, press pause. And right, yeah, don't forget to take a paper and a pen or pencil to record your answers. You will check the answers on the video after you release the pause button or you press the play button. So let's start. Let's start with the first question. On All Saints Day, Christians remember the holy people. Press pause if you need more time to think. Have you got the answer? That's right! On All Saints Day, Christians remember the saints. Good, let's go with the second question. To frighten the ghosts, People dressed like devils. Don't forget to press pause. Have you got the answer? That's right! To scare the ghosts, people dressed like devils. Let's go with question number three. Children wear something to cover their faces. Press pause if you need more time. Ding. Have you got the answer? That's right! Children wear masks. Good. Let's go with question number four. Children want to look like all the bones that make the body. 
Can you guess the word? Have you got the answer? That's right! Children want to look like skeletons. Question number five. The jack-o'-lantern is to scare the people with no bodies that come back after they die. Press pause if you need more time. Have you got the answer? That's right! The jack-o'-lantern is to scare the ghosts. And question number six. <laughs> when people give nothing, the children do something to make them look stupid. And this is the last one, so be careful. Have you got the answer? That's right! When people give nothing, the children play tricks. Congratulations! That was awesome. You're getting better and better all the time. Would you like to do some war fight activities? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I can't hear you. Right. Let's do a quiz. For this activity, you need to split up in three groups. So, let's do it. One, two, three. One, two, three. And move on. Your teacher will give you three cards to your group. A, B, and C. For each question that you will see on the screen, you will have three options to choose from. A, B, or C. You decide which card best represents your answer, show it to the teacher, and if your answer is correct, your team scores a point. Shall we do it? Alright, you ready? Let's start. What do people celebrate on 31st of October? A. All Saints Day B. Halloween or C. Christianity Think. Press pause if you need more time. Have you got the answer? Let's see. That's right! The answer is B. Halloween. Good one. Let's go with the next one. Question number two. Who brought Halloween to America from Europe? A. Saints. B. Children. Or C. Immigrants. What's your answer? Press pause if you need more time. That's, that's correct. That's right. Your answer is C, immigrants. Let's move on to the third question. What do children do if people don't give them treats? A, they play tricks on them. B, they go trick-or-treating. Or C, they go home crying. What's your answer? Press pause. That's right. They play tricks on them. Really nasty ones. Let's go with question number four. Which of the following is not a Halloween symbol? A. Jack-o'-lantern B. Star or C. Ghost What's your answer? What's your answer? What's your answer? That's right! B. Star is not a Halloween symbol. Question number five. Halloween today is a holiday, A, popular with children, B, for people who give nothing, or C, for special people. What's your answer? That's right! Halloween today is a holiday popular with children. Congratulations. What's going on? It's time for break.
better now. All right, that was great. You did a good job. And we had a great time. Would you like some more fun activities? Is it okay? All right. Now, take a look at this Halloween crossword. Can you work it out? And here are the clues. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Oh, hi everyone. I hope you enjoyed this Halloween lesson. And I know we had a great time, didn't we? So see you next time. Trick or treat everyone! <laughs>